Ray writes, peace to the saints. Ladies the saints. on the panel, what's your type of man you prefer regarding looks, social status, and financial status? I like how he breaks those up. That's yeah. fascinating. Okay. Yeah, let's hear this. I am very All fascinated right. to yeah, hear We're going to do it on a scale of one through ten on each, okay? So okay. here we go. We're going we're gonna to round out the guy. We're going to start with uh, Diana oh and gosh. we're going to go away. Uh, uh, Kathy? Yeah. All right, Kathy. perfect. <laughs> Oh, is it well, Catherine? Kath- no, it's Catherine, <laughs> but everyone calls like, me you Kathy. Call me okay. Kathy. All right, so here nice. we go. All right, uh, on a scale of one through ten on looks, what do you prefer the guy to be? On a scale of one through ten, what can you control? <laughs> this is like hard for me to answer because of what she was saying earlier mm-hmm. about like, you know, the guy who's like the most attractive is typically also like the biggest asshole, you know. So then it's like. Like, obviously, everybody's going to want to say, I want 10, 10, 10. You know, yeah. like, why wouldn't you say that? But but, but Catherine reason. just said she didn't. So come on, y'all. Give me an answer. <laughs> I don't know. Y'all, y'all see when you ask okay, them how- a question, they just start talking like, let me say have- nothing to do with anything. This, this conversation is reminding me of a quote. <clears throat> oh, she about to get scholarly. <laughs> she didn't clear her throat. Go ahead. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Okay. Every man wants a good girl to mm-hmm. be bad just for him. And every girl wants a bad guy to be good just for her. Okay, now, and here's quote? my quote. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you're talking about. Give right? me a number, <laughs> one through ten. That is my quote. <laughs> We're playing games. All right, all right. Come on. I'm what you go looking at? Uh, Come on, baby. What Give me some. I'm going to go with a nine. You want a nine? That's <laughs> high. You want a nine? That's high. Right. Okay. Come on. What's up? I was gonna say a nine too. <laughs> you are out. You lying? And on not, here. you know how I know you lying though? Because she already told the truth. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> she already told the truth. <laughs> let me let me uh, go into these other pieces too. And I like these questions. So, what is the actual profile of this guy? If we're like from a looks perspective, like what ethnicity is he most likely to be? Um, what does he look like? How's he dressed? Give me a little taste of that. The biggest thing for me out of what you said is how uh-huh. he dresses. That's okay. a big thing for me. If you like right. dress nice and you care about yourself, like hygiene, like all of that kind of thing, like how how great Breezy's haircut is right now. Uh-huh. Fresh. <laughs> you know right. what I mean? That's something that women notice about men. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. It's like if you take care of yourself, it's not just how you dress, but like. What's like a no go on the look hygiene. side? What's a no go? What's what's something that make you say I'm out on Messed the look side? Teeth. Messed Crocs. up teeth. Dang. <laughs> I feel you on that one. Dang, okay. messed up teeth. That was, that was fucked. Messed up teeth. Damn, that's okay. If you can't, like, you know, you got to smile in yeah. pictures. If you, and if you got a messed up Ooh. smile and teeth. Okay. Mm. I think I didn't, I didn't like, smash the couple of chicks that was real cute in the face, but the teeth was not right, though. <laughs> yeah. For oh, sure. Big turn like, because, you know, it'd be the cutest girls that be having sometimes jacked up smiles. Like, back in high school, I know that was, like, a big thing. Ooh. The cutest girl in the whole school had teeth that was crazy. <laughs> to, and I hate to say this, but when a chick has jacked up teeth in America, it's like, shorty, you grew up poor, poor. Because your parents, nine out of nine, would have got that taken care of if they could have, right? Especially yeah. if you're a girl, right? <laughs> Obamacare. Yeah, yeah they'd have got that taken <laughs> care of. So yo ass grew up poor, poor. Uh, that hurts my heart. Okay, for sure. So you said jacked up teeth. You said Crocs. Does that include a man <laughs> bun? Can you get by with a man bun or no? Yeah, I think a man bun yeah. can be done can be done good. I'm it, done with but you. But it has to I'm be right. You. you know what I mean? It has to be right. I can't even smash you now. Like, <laughs> I can't do it. No, seriously, because, guys, I want you guys to know how I look at things. I like to look at who used to be in there and ask myself, does he measure up to me? Because if I feel like a weirdo was in there before me, I'm like, this might not be a place for me to be. You know what I'm saying? Like, if the dude with the man bun was in there, I'm like, if she letting guys like this in, I don't know who been in here. I can't be walking up in this house like me? that. Jason yeah. I don't even know who I, that is. You, you know, know how is? accurate you know that, who is? that is? Aquaman. Yeah. I remember. <laughs> I remember it was this, cartoons. It was this one yeah. chick back in LA. I was trying uh-huh. to smash, bro. Yeah. Never got to doing it. Nonetheless, it was this one dude she did smash. Uh-huh. And then I sit back and I'm like, I couldn't even mess with her after that. My brain just right just started to just wombo jumbo. Long story short, I had heard. She started being like an advocate for herpes. Wait, what? She called herpes. <laughs> what? Messing with weird niggas. What? Yes, sir. Lord. Yep. Yeah. Um, yeah. Damn. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. For me, it just turns me off. Like for me, it gets me scared. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I get scared. Like if I see the the well, your weird ex, in there. if your ex is like, uh, if he ain't right, like it turns me off, and it feel like you've been dealing with like some like rascals. <laughs> but if your ex was like a fly cat, like I like that. Just like. 
you know, as a player, I like to be like, oh yeah, like that was a cool cat. Like, yeah, mm-hmm. like that's what's up. Like we're, we're maintaining a level here. Things are beautiful. I feel the same way. Yeah. I don't know if it's like not really a womanly thing, <laughs> but I feel the same way. Like if I know that like you used to hook up with this girl that I don't think is like on the same level that I am, I'm going to be like, all right, I can do better. But you you'll be I mean? sleeping with guys with man buns though. Yeah, not <laughs> like, what are you guys, doing I've here? I've said that there's some of them who can that's do not it cool. right. That's that, some. That is not, not cool all, at not all. all. Like Again, it's if you can tell that you're. Taking I'm care turned of off right now. Man, Bumby, <laughs> this <right>. big, huh? <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, cool. Um, on the look side, like, what about your? Wait, wait. You've been with a black guy before. <laughs> Damn! Wow, just started so? laughing. I know so. I can feel it. Yes or no? I have, I have. Yeah. Of course. And she managed to do that while growing up in Alaska. So that's a beautiful <laughs> thing. Are we talking about Anchorage or Ketchikan? Where are we at with it? Anchorage. Okay, that's what's up. Yeah. yeah. Now, if you grew up in Alaska and you managed to have been with a black guy like you, you're with the shits because we don't like cold. You yeah. have not been with a black guy. And I think that's a part of your challenge in life. Oh I really think that we need to figure this out mm. so you can make progress in life. <laughs> you feel me? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, yeah, I'm not sold. Fuck you. <laughs> um, she's like, I'm, not, I'm out. I'm out. I tried it. I grew up in Vegas. You went to private school in Vegas? No, I didn't. Okay. Damn. You went to public school in Vegas? Mm-hmm. I mean, I, I did. I did. It was semi-public. Look, like magnet what, what, schools. Okay, the nerd school. That's yeah. what's up. I feel like, like finished college at twenty. Okay, so, that's what's up. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Cool. Wow. Um, I just finished college at twenty three. <laughs> Way to make me feel bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're a little bit late. It's okay though. But I got three things. <clears throat> yes. Um, <laughs> right here it says financial status. Um, would you feel fine if your boyfriend just stayed at the same financial status? No. Oh, why? Because. I think we both uh-huh. right now deserve more because okay. we just got out. Like, well, he just got out of college. He literally also just graduated like two weeks ago. Okay. Well, mm-hmm. um, are you smarter than him? You know, I. <laughs> no, it's so funny. No, 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 just no, give no, me no, a no, yes. No, 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 because it's so funny. We literally had this conversation in the sense that I think he's so much more smarter than me. Like, uh-huh. he is well, like spoken. Like, he can write an essay. Like, freaking in an hour like right. literally 10 pages like i'm not even joking mm-hmm. he helped me get through college like i'm like no joke but i'm more... he helped you get through college but he yeah. didn't help himself get through college no he did he graduated you graduated at 20 he because graduated at 23 i, I took other <laughs> <laughs> like, I took other he should have quit helping you and helping <laughs> himself but now go ahead because oh, yeah. i took alternative like routes and stuff so okay but anyways, but I'm more hardworking. Like I'm more I'm disciplined in the that. sense of like, look, like the fact I graduated at 20 because mm-hmm. I made sacrifices to like leave my current high school to go to the community college and do college and high school at the same time. Okay. You know, I've had three jobs at one point, you know, like I'm oh, not afraid. What are you, Jamaican? Like, what are you doing that for? Like, like you No, got to all get jobs. through like to, you know, accomplish my goals and okay. my dreams. What, what are your dreams? Honestly, <laughs> dreams. they've changed. I don't tell, know where I'm at. Tell me. Right oh, now. you you need a dream. I know. That's I good because I'm selling dreams. All right. Okay, that's what's sell up. Sell me a dream. Oh, you better believe I am. <laughs> okay. Very. This good. one right here, she open. Uh huh. She open to it. No. Oh, for Look, real, she said, though. "Sell me a dream." Yeah. No, <laughs> stop it. Better, it better be a job, though. Oh. Better be a job. No, that's good. That's really good. Um. Yeah, because you're you're doing real estate right now, right? Yeah, I am. That's pretty neat. Okay, yeah. cool. Mm. Um, so you would not be comfortable if your boyfriend stays at the same financial level. Mm, yeah. Guys are often saying, Marquette, a lot of these chicks, it's all about the money. And if the finances stayed the same, that's a money thing. But he continues being the great guy that he is. Why is that not good enough? Mm-hmm. I think it would be good enough. It, 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 <laughs> I know I contradict myself a lot. <laughs> you just totally did. Mariah, can no. you come stab me in the eye, please? <laughs> can you please just stab no, me I, in the I eye. mean, like, in the sense that, obviously, the goal is to make more, both of us, uh-huh. you know? But, I mean, if, if, if things didn't change... No, they won't change. I'm going to change. <laughs> Damn, okay. <laughs> oh, if, if he don't get the job done, you going to get the job done? Yeah, I'm going to... Or get somebody him. else to get the job done? I'm Uh-oh. Gonna, uh-oh. Hello. <laughs> I would Hello. encourage him to. Okay. Yeah. Do you feel like, um, do you want a man to be your leader and the leader of the family, or are you guys like 50 50 leaders? 
I that's a tricky one. I, I appreciate feel, that I'm putting you in deep thought. Like yeah. <laughs> I appreciate no, that. No, because I, I feel both. I think like some things can be 50 50 okay. and then other things I do just want him to take the lead and just like, like yeah, like roll with it. Okay. You know? All right. Like what would what would be something you say, you know, I want my man to take the lead on this? Like planning a vacation. <laughs> that's ironic because that's one of the things I never take the lead on. Yeah. Yeah. I never just take like, the lead on planning vacations. Like, just surprise me, take me on a vacation. Um, he ain't got money like that. Didn't we just get, <laughs> didn't we just go through that part? I, like, damn, rush out of college. Yeah, he's putting pressure on this man. He's not broke. Nah. He's not broke, but I know we can be at a better place. Yeah. Okay. Nah, I'm I'm teasing you. Okay, so you said <laughs> I'm gonna let him take lead on planning a vacation for me. Yes. Okay, <laughs> got you. That's fantastic. All right, so basically you're gonna be 50 50 leaders, is what you're saying. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Part. What about you? I feel pretty much the same way that like he does. Damn. Like because I'm I've always been a pretty independent person. I feel like I'm an independent woman. All like, my single ladies, <laughs> all my single ladies. But uh, like at the same time, I'm super independent. But at the same time, I don't, I don't like to be by myself. You know what I mean? I like to have other people right. around me, but I don't have to. Like I can be independent, but I don't like to be independent. Mm. Tell me if I'm saying something. Crazy. It's not. I like being independent, but I don't like to be alone. Why am Does that I? Make sense? Is there a difference? Why am I so confused when I speak? <laughs> why? Why do you do this to me? What is wrong with you guys? <laughs> being independent and like somebody who's kind of like a loner like somebody who likes to be by themselves can you can you be a healer and a killer a, what? Mm, a healer a and a killer can you be a healer and a killer oh like have you yes oh shit yeah. i think you can be yeah. i had to put the extreme there to just see if I've that seen, would happen i've seen some shows about like crazy surgeons and shit like that you know what i mean <laughs> like they're like a hey, surgeon y'all. during the day and like serious shout out to the night. female brain bro Shout out to the female. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, uh, we got a baller alert. Baller, baller alert! alert! Robert Jones writes Chutch. And you know, leave that picture up for a second, because I think he low-key, he was he was sitting there listening to the live stream, saying to himself, like, okay, Shorty right there, Catherine. He's like, I kind of like Shorty, and, he, <laughs> and I know she like guys with a body. And, you know, so I'm going to just pull up in the picture with the no. shirt off on her with the baller alert. Let her know, baby, I got the money and the muscles, the M and the M, you dig? So can he get in the game? Because I think he's trying to holler at you, though. That's what I'm seeing. Because he said, I know you like the CrossFit guys. I, you, see, <laughs> you see I'm chiseled up and the money game is strong er than your current man. So um, what it do? Can he get in the game? No. Shout out to Robert, man. Yeah. Hey, Why are you on about my only Robert? No. Stop disrespecting people on this. Huh. Spot, man. Robert. Hey, Robert, mm-hmm. don't worry. We're going to get her for you, man. We <laughs> yeah. got you. Yeah, we're going to slide them DMs. We got you, Robert. 